Have you ever stopped to ponder just how limitless God's power is? Us humans, we love predicting outcomes, yet God can flip all our expectations on their head. In this video, we're going to delve into the amazing way God operates, using the weak to overcome the strong, the humble to best the proud. You don't want to miss out on this revelation, it's a divine message that has the potential to bless your life today. Subscribe to the channel and share this video, so that more people can receive this blessing. First, let's kick off with Joseph, a biblical character whose life was filled with a series of ups and downs. Joseph was the dreamer, the visionary, the cherished son of Jacob, but also the outcast, the slave, and the prisoner. Despite being sold by his own brothers, a heart-wrenching betrayal beyond understanding, this hideous circumstance wasn't the end of his story, but the beginning of a journey of blessing and prosperity mapped out by God. As Joseph adjusted to life in Egypt, it was no cakewalk. He wasn't just betrayed by his brothers, but was also unjustly accused and imprisoned. It seemed like all doors were closing in on him. However, even in the darkest hours, Joseph never lost his faith in God. Amid all adversities, he continued to believe that God was by his side, guiding each step of the way. Indeed, God was with Joseph. When the Pharaoh of Egypt needed someone to interpret his dreams, God gave Joseph the wisdom necessary to decipher the meaning of these dreams. This act of wisdom and faith led Joseph to rise to a position of great power and authority in Egypt. Those who betrayed and mistreated him now watched as Joseph became a powerful and respected figure. God used what seemed like the end of Joseph as the beginning of something new. What Joseph's brothers intended for evil, God turned into something good. Joseph's story is a resounding testament to God's power to turn seemingly devastating situations into a source of countless blessings. Now, let's move on to another biblical story. The story of a woman who suffered from a debilitating disease for many years. She had exhausted all resources and all hopes in the search for a cure, but nothing seemed to work. She was isolated, forgotten, and desperate. However, one day she heard about a man named Jesus, who performed miracles and healed the sick. Driven by faith, this woman risked everything to find Jesus. Amid a crowd, she reached out and touched Jesus' cloak. At that exact moment, her disease was healed. Here again we see God's power. The woman, seen as weak and desperate by the world, was healed by her unshakable faith. God used her weakness to display his mighty strength and compassion. Through these two stories, we can see the paradox of God's power. He uses the weak to shame the strong, the insignificant to confound the great, the humble to humble the proud. No matter how hopeless, powerless, or desperate a situation may seem, God has the power to turn it into a victory. This is the core truth of the gospel. God uses the most difficult circumstances and the most unlikely people to perform the greatest miracles. He uses the weak to shame the strong and the humble to topple the proud. In his divine wisdom, God turns defeats into victories, weaknesses into strengths, and trials into triumphs. This doesn't mean our lives will always be easy. There will be challenges, setbacks, and disappointments. There will be times when we feel overwhelmed by life's circumstances. However, amidst it all, we can be assured that God is with us. He is our refuge and strength, an ever-present help in adversity. Whatever situation you are facing today, know that God is greater. He has the power to turn your difficulty into an opportunity, your pain into purpose, and your suffering into joy. As the psalmist wrote, Weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. And when we are weak, that's when we're strong. Because it is in our weakness that God's power is made perfect. It's in our trials that we find His grace. It's in our challenges that we experience His victory. And it's in our darkest moments that we see the light of His presence shine brightest. God hasn't left us in our struggles. On the contrary, He promised to be with us in all circumstances, 
turning our trials into triumphs, our obstacles into opportunities, and our pains into purpose. In Christ, we are more than conquerors. And even if we can't see God's work in our lives right now, we can be assured that He is working for our good. Therefore, no matter how tough the fight, no matter how big the mountain, no matter how deep the valley, God is by our side. He's working even when we can't see it. And He promised that all things work together for good for those who love Him and are called according to His purpose. So, let's be encouraged and strengthened in faith. God is with us, and in His sovereign providence, He is working all things for our good. So, even in the face of tough situations, insurmountable challenges, God still performs miracles. Because our God is a God of possibilities, a God of miracles. So, no matter what you're going through, trust in God, because all things work together for good for those who love God. If this message touched your heart, please leave your like and share this video with those you love. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to receive more messages like this. Until the next video, God bless.